Yo, we're moving right along this album, fam. Oh, we're on to the next track. Joiner Lucas, straight like that, off of Evolution. Roll it. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Channel's name is The Third Ernest. I'm Ernest Adiano the Third. Y'all guys, third family. If you're new here and you're not subscribed and you like what you see at the end of the video, consider clicking the subscribe button and joining our little family, bottom right hand corner. Now we are almost one, two, three, four, five, six. I think we're on like track number seven or eight on the EP, but we skipped both skits that have been on the album so far. And we also skipped Snitch because I already made a video for that video, which will be at the end card of this video if you wanna just go directly to it. And so far, we're almost halfway through the album. Album, I believe and so far the album is solid like money we haven't there has not been a single bad song yet but that's really all that I got to say follow your boy on Instagram and on Twitter at the third earnest just like the channel the links are down in the description below and we're moving right along straight like that Joiner Lucas let's get it Fingers to my foes, straight like that. Yeah. This is a true story ever told, straight like that. Uh. Yo, see what I mean? Like the, like the rhythm of the album is amazing. Like, like we were hyped for the last two tracks. Zim Zima or whatever the hell the name of that track was. And then we went to Snitch right after that. Like those two tracks have crazy energy. The energy of the last two tracks has been like really high, especially coming off of that soulful track with the game. And then now we're down here. Now we brought it back down to like a chill level. So like the pacing of the album has been amazing. Like that. Yeah. It's a true story ever told, straight like that. Uh. On my phone, we speak a code, straight like that. Just that shit that keep a money toe, straight like that. How Ooh. many niggas we that 808 bass that came in right there? But by the way, I just paused it because on the phone, speaking in code straight like that, like literally people are tapped into your phone, FBI, DEA, so you got to speak in code. It's kind of like, have you ever seen the movie Casino? That's what it means by speaking in code. You're saying something that sounds not that suspicious on the phone, but really it's a secret code between you and whoever's talking about drugs or about, you know, gang life or whatever. That might seem straightforward to a lot of people, but I promise to a lot of people that is not a straightforward line. How many niggas reach their goals straight like that? How many niggas folded so they told straight like that? Uh, cut you off, you had to go straight like that. I just need some space for me to grow straight like that. If it's fuck me, then it's fuck you straight like that. You ain't hard to fight for me to touch you straight like that. Had to grind, had to hustle straight like that. Gained a peace of mind from the struggle straight like that. Mm. Gained a peace of mind from the struggle. Fire, dog. This whole song, it's not like the. Again, I, I say it on every Joyner song because Joyner's not like really a bar heavy in terms of wordplay type of rapper. That's not his lyrical style. His lyrical style is realness. And that's really the song. That's all the song is. It's like, you know, it's just. It's, it's it basically every line is its own sentence. That's why he's ending it with straight like that. I cut you off. You had to go straight like that. You know, I need a space so I could grow. Like it's like it's nothing personal. It, it, I'm just giving it to you straight. I'm telling you exactly what needs to be said. So there is no like getting lost in wordplay because that wouldn't be straight like that. If it's fuck me, then it's fuck you. Like I'm not going to try and fucking repair any kind of relationship. It just is what it is. Like that. Multi platinum sell a millionaire straight like that. Those who think I owe him wasn't there, straight like that. Ooh. A couple dollars in the prayer, straight like that. Ain't a single nigga that I fear, straight like that. Dog, a couple dollars in the prayers. Like, like, please God, let me get to this fortune. Please God, let me get to this fame because we come from the struggle. When you don't have money, money is the one thing that you're concerned about the most. And people with money don't know that kind of struggle. They're not asking for God to like to grant them fortune because they already got it. Just such a clever way of self saying and, and relating to people who are in the struggle that he comes from the struggle because he's he also has asked God plenty of times to like to help him with his with his money or have him have him come up on some money. You know, and he says, those you think I owe him wasn't there straight like that. That's just the facts. That just is what it is. Like, I don't owe you shit because you weren't there for me on the grind. You, you weren't there supporting me. So what do I owe you? Not a goddamn thing. Yo, th this whole, this whole, all of these chill, the, like these more chill songs, the first one, the second one with the game, and then now this one straight like that, they all have like that Nipsey Hustle vibe. Like it's just, just that realness over like a chill beat, you know, just talking or not, where it's not really a flow, but it's flowing. It's just, it's just so good. You want to fade it and running it. Give it the way that you wanted it. I never knew what the money would do. If I knew then I wouldn't want none of it. Ooh. Niggas, I thought I was cool with a scheme, but they want to dat me in public. I'm starting to think that I'm numb to it. I want my heart on my sleeve with the side of the cover. It went to how crazy my son. 
Bro, I want I wear my heart on my sleeve like I have all my emotions. I show them to the world, but I had to cover it because the world's a fucking cold place. It is too cold to be keeping my emotions in front and center like that. I had to keep I had to guard myself. These dudes that I thought I was cool with is actually scheming and plotting on the low. They're trying to get at me. They're trying to get out my bread. But then in public, they want to dap me up. That's like I can't I can't expose my I can't expose my emotions and my vulnerability to those type of personalities. So I cover my heart on my sleep. And he said, I never knew what the money could do. If I would have known, then I wouldn't want none of it. Like that's a that's a sentiment of anybody who's come like into quick money, like how everybody switches up on you. Either everybody comes a hater, everybody comes a beggar, everybody says that they knew from the beginning when they was doubting you from the beginning like i just wanted to rap i just wanted to be mildly successful and, and provide for my son but this hyper at this hyper money this hyper uh, like you know a-list level of rap this isn't anything that i wanted just like eminem says plenty of times i wrote a book in the berry to cover it hope that he never discover it wonder if he only knew all the shit that he up against i gotta put me in front of it i want it all and they only want some of it i think i need me a ton of it they wanted drama until i decided to straight like that straight like that straight like that straight they wanted drama till I actually decided to come and meet them. Like you, you put that line in the sand thinking I wasn't gonna cross. And now I'm over here. What's up? Yeah, look, sober minds is my regime. Straight like that. Wow. I don't do no drugs or sip no lean. Straight like that. Yeah. Crack turn my cousin to a fiend. Straight like that. I just hope one day he might get clean. Straight like that. No, the, the whole straight like that is like fire to end every single bar with that. Like, yo, I'm just giving you the facts straight. I'm just telling you, you know, man to man, this is what I come from. This is what the money's done. This is what I want for my son. This is what I see. This is why I guard my heart. Like all of that is dope. Like I'm, I'm sober. I don't live that fight. I don't drink. I don't smoke. I don't do drugs. I seen my cousin get turned to a fiend from that crack rut. Like that just is what it is. That's where I come from. Pop the shit, I'll make a scene straight like that. I might take the shit to be extreme straight like that. Yeah. That's my team, straight like that. If they don't buy my shit, then they go stream straight like that. Ooh. New bitch in my crib. They don't buy my shit, they gon' stream like I'm doing right now. Dope. Crib, I might just get her straight like that. I just flip her over, I don't kiss her straight like that. Uh -huh. I ain't fallin' for no stripper straight like that. I said fuck the labels, then got richer straight like that. I said fuck the labels and got richer on my own independent artist doing it through YouTube straight to the fucking fans. I got richer because even if I had more, even if I had more reach with a label, the, the label would have taken most of that money. So I'm richer being independent with a smaller audience than I ever would have been with a label and a huger and a bigger audience. Dope. And he said, I ain't falling for no stripper. They don't want to be saved, dog. Straight like that. Used to struggle, now we icy straight like that. Hope my daughter don't mean no one like me straight like that. Ooh. If she do, he gotta fight me straight like that. Someone gotta pay and shit get pricey straight like that. Hop in the floor and I swear Dog, it. someone gotta pay and shit get pricey. Like eventually you gotta reap what you sow. You gotta pay the Pied Piper and I don't think you can cash in in the way that you want to. You've been running your mouth and eventually you're gonna get popped because that's the cost of running your mouth. That shit gets pricey. That's fire. And he said, I hope my daughter don't ever meet no one like me. They do say that bad men or men with a troubled past or who've made mistakes or used women, they have females as God's revenge to them, you know? The pricey straight like that. Hop in the floor and I'm swearing it. They want a dish and I'm serving it. Word to the niggas who thought I was leaving. I told them I'm staying as permanent. Ooh. Typical nigga been hurting these women and feelings they wasn't deserving it. I broke their heart and I'm sure of it. I did some damage. I hope that one day I can learn from it. That probably won't be the first of it. See, he just said like right there, I've been, I've basically fucked these women over. I did damage and I hope one day I can learn from it. And I might not even be able to learn if I, until I have a daughter and see her heart broken by a dude that treated that treated her in the same way that I treated these other bitches who have fathers that had to see their heart get broken too. Ah, shit comes full circle. It's the way life works. I'm on my journey. I felt like a journalist. Never had many alternatives. Only way out is to murder it. I gotta murder it. I bet that you be observing it. I'm all the way up. Only way out is to murder it, and I gotta murder it. It's the only way I like murder the beat. Murder it. I bet that you be observing it. I'm all the way up and I'm feeling the turbulence. I need my peace. You disturbing it. You put some drama inside of my pocket. Straight like that. Straight like that. Straight like that. Straight like that. I'm on my way up and I'm feeling the turbulence, bro, because because nobody you're going against the grain on the way to the top. People start falling off from by your side like it's a lonely spot at the top and people are trying to hold you down. So you feel the turbulence trying to go against the grain, just like you would feel the turbulence in a plane when you're at a certain height. And then now you're experiencing like you're flying through a storm. I'm starting to feel the turbulence. That's fire. Straight like that, straight like that, straight like that, straight. Like that. Dog. All right, song's over. Yo.
That song, it's not gonna be everybody's favorite. I can tell you right out the gate, just because it's slow. There's no like, there's no like crazy bars, which is kind of what. There's no conceptualization in the track, other than the fact that he's just giving it to you straight. It's not gonna be everybody's favorite song in the track, especially coming off the last two tracks, which were crazy hype and crazy energy. I like the drop in energy into this track coming off of the from coming off of the last two, and I like the, like the realness and the smoothness. But he's still spitting that real shit. But I already know it's just like not gonna be everybody's favorite song. So if I had to pin a track as, as the weakest so far on the album, it would probably be this one. But that's not to say that this track is weak. That's just to say that the other ones are going to be more appealing to a bigger audience. And and as like an introspective type of track or like or like talking to you like straight up being being real with you. The first two tracks evolution and then and then the other one with the game. Those are going to be stronger tracks of this style. But yo, that brings us to the end of this video. Ladies and gentlemen, we're rolling right along. If you liked it, please consider liking the video. Leave in a comment down below if you like what you see enough please consider subscribing and hitting the notification bell because we still have like six or seven tracks on this album that we got to get through if you like what you see enough enough and you're in a position to be able to support the channel monetarily by giving a couple of dollars a month go check out the patreon first link down in the description below it's not a handout it's more like a membership you get behind the scenes stuff you get a song of the day from my personal playlist so you can start to understand what i'm listening to you know you get early release you get requests all these different things but that's really the only way that the channel goes is I am full time on YouTube because of the people who are willing to, to help the channel by by subscribing per month over there. Follow your boy on Instagram and on Twitter at the third earnest just like the channel the links are down in the description below. Discord also linked down in the description below if you want to chat it up with me that's the best place to do it. But that's all that I got to say for you today ladies and gentlemen I appreciate your time and like I always say at the end of all of my videos go out there in the world love and care for one another love and care for each other and I catch everybody on the next video. Peace.